YTBC what's the deal so Shannon Briggs will not be fighting uh Jacob Gospic is some other cat Zarati Zarada you know at this point with uh Shannon Briggs man I just want this weekend to get over as far as uh the thing that um him and David Hay has going on you know if they really want to fight each other man they should have just made the fight for May 21st you know I understand Arnold Jarek Jai is 29 and no uh God or Switzerland um, and I've actually came out with videos and you can go check them months ago I came out with videos saying that I think Arnold Jarek Jai needs to go to the UK or come to the USA to get him a good fight A good meaningful fight because nobody was gonna go out there to Switzerland So he took my advice, you know, what I mean he got a fight with David Hayes. So in that sense, that's great But as far as us the fans though, man, we were getting, you know, pulled around By our collar man with this whole uh who Shannon Briggs' opponent is going to be. I like Shannon Briggs. Hell, I have Shannon Briggs on my intro, you know, for my channel. I like the enthusiasm that he brings. He's a former champion. He brings that to the table. He's he's in shape for an old guy. Well, he's in shape, you know what I mean? Especially for a, a guy in his 40s. Um, But, you know, these... First, it was supposed to be Alexander Dimitrenko, and then after that, you know, now from Shannon's side, he's saying that Dimitrenko pulled out of the fight. Um, Demetrenko had even even came out I've seen on one site saying he's going to knock Shannon Briggs out And then May 3rd he came out with something on his Twitter Saying that uh, the fight's not going on So then it was this Jacob Gospic guy um, I reported that because I heard it from Fight News That he was a possible opponent I didn't say it was written in stone I said it was a possibility um, Then that got pulled And then now I'm seeing Z uh, Zarati um, I heard that name's a journeyman guy But I almost want to say this should just give Jarek Jai some step aside money, man. Like literally, let him fight like Dillian White or Tyson Fury or something like, or not Tyson Fury, but Huey Fury or something like that. Actually, that'd be a good fight. Huey Fury versus uh, Arnold Jarek Jai. That that would have been a good fight. And they could have just had Shannon Briggs versus David Hay. That's what they should have done. But um, neither here nor there, man. Briggs going against Zarati. Hope I'm pronouncing his name right. I expect Briggs to knock him out within a round or two. Pretty much. David Hay, I expect him to get Arnold Jarek Jai out of there. Now, Jarek Jai does have a good right. He, now, he has the size, man. This isn't just, he isn't a complete, complete chump like some fans make out to be. Um, He does have a good right hand, and he can be fleet on his uh, feet when he wants to. Depends what kind of shape he comes in at. When I seen him fight at, two, I think he was like 230, 228 or something like that, he looked pretty mobile for a big guy. You know, but it was a fight where he was fighting downhill. He didn't really have anything to worry about coming back at him. Um, but I expect David Hay to be him because I think David Hay is a, is on a higher level, and there's levels to this shit. And I think David Hay is just a better fighter. Um, Jarek Jai, like I said, he needs to be more in a fight where he's trying to prove himself to get a big fight. Just 29 and 0 to me just isn't enough. Um, Dennis Boktov, he's fought. And Boktov even put him down. You know, um, what was the other guy that he fought? Um, man. Reds and I forgot the guy's name, but it's the guy, um, it was, the fight was in Switzerland, the guy was undefeated, I forgot the guy's name, man. Forgot the guy's name, but that was an entertaining fight. Then his other fights just been against guys that were completely overmatched, you know, way shorter, guys are really out of shape, um, but Arnold Jerry Jai did what he had to do against those guys. I have to give him that, you know what I mean? But uh, his toughest fight to me was Dennis Boktov, you know what I mean? And um, I even heard Dillian White say that uh, Arnold Jerry Jai was out at a camp. I forgot which camp it was at, but Dillian White, I think it was a Klitschko camp. White was at the camp, Anthony Joshua, and a few other guys. And they say that uh, Arnold Jerry Jai was getting the hell beat out of him. That was according to Dillian White, you know what I mean? So... I don't know, man. I'm just getting it out there that uh, Shannon Briggs has a new opponent, and the weigh-in went down today. So, just waiting for these. You know, I'm going to watch the fights. Don't don't get it twisted. I'm going to watch these fights, but um, just kind of wish Briggs and uh, Hay was just fighting tomorrow. You know, instead of putting this through these through this shit, man. And uh, Briggs having now this is the third opponent. I'm not blaming Briggs, man, but just as a fan, I want to see Hay versus Briggs now. You know what I mean? But just getting this out there, though. YTBC.